still tough on me. Uh, I'm not even going to lie. Uh, you know, you work so hard for one goal, and, and you know, you, you, and we fell short. So um, it's tough, you know. Um, we've been through a lot as a team this year. You know, I've been through a lot myself this year. You know, so, but I'm, I'm definitely proud of how we, we handled the adversity and kept going, you know, so that's. AJ, speaking on um, kind of adversity, what you guys had to overcome, I guess, with that, I mean, how much of that was kind of that in-house belief that kind of no matter what, you guys were kind of that championship level team? Um, in sh- internal sense. Yeah, for sure. I think, I think it just, um, the way we just handle things each and every day, you know, um, you know, in life, we have problems with thrown at us. You know, football is the same thing. You know, you got to learn a way to adjust and, and move forward. And uh, and I think that's what we did this year, you know. Um, we just fell we just fell short at the end. And But, you know, we we always had that next man up mentality and just push through adversity no matter what, we find a way. So, um, but we, this time, we just fell short. You've been through this before. Mm-hmm. How tough is this day? You're looking for Dave. This team's not going to be the same next year. They're trying to change the body guy. Yeah, man, it's a tough day. It's a tough day because, you know, this team, I'm not going to play with the same team. Uh, and, um, you know, I, I wish it was different, you know, but it's the nature of the business. You know, I, I kind of wish it was like college. You can keep guys around and you can build and grow together. But, you know, people people go their separate ways, and I know they're trying to do what's best for their family. You know, so it's just a part of it, and that's the part I just don't like about it. What did you learn about yourself and about this team through all you went through and what did you take going forward? Um, like I like I spoke on the, the strength of this team, the, the the core of it uh, is strong. You know, we care about each other and we try to push through things, push through adversity. You know, that's that's what's important. That's what I learned most importantly about this team. That we're strong. We have a, a strong core. So. Hey, hey, the offensive numbers were down kind of across the board for you guys this year. Mm-hmm. How much do you factor injuries into that? How much is it other reasons beyond or besides injuries? Um. For, for me personally, you know, I, I can't put up stats if I'm not on the field. So, you know, uh, uh, I got banged up a little bit this year, but, you know, it is what it is. You know, I, I wouldn't change it either way, you know, because, uh, you know, last year it was difficult for me, you know, and this and this year I knew how to handle it, you know. So I'm proud of myself, you know, no matter what, you know. You know I stood tall, I took all the blows, so, you know, for me personally, so, you know. The team overall, like offensively overall, do you uh, most, most definitely, I, I, I would definitely think you know injuries are part of this game. You know that we don't like about it, but it's a part of it. We play a physical game, and you know when you don't have your guys on the field, you, you know your numbers are gonna be down. So. This day sucks every year, but given what you accomplished this year, the one seed home field, mm-hmm. does this day suck a little bit more this time around? I think it does because you know um, we were in position to to do something real special. We we had you know the red carpet here through Nashville, you know and. and that's what we wanted. That's what we talked about, you know. And and this and this time, you know, it's it's like it's been levels, you know. When the AFC the AFC South Division, you know, won that twice, and now we got the home field advantage, you know, and, and it's levels. And and I really feel like this year was a year to 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 make it happen. Stylistically, you confident so. that, that the way you guys play can get it can get it done when you're watching these other teams sling it all over the place. Um, that, this this is what we do here. You know, we run the ball and and then, and then we we play action. That's what we do here. So uh, I can't speak on uh, other uh, whatever what people other people, you know. Uh, but that's what we do here, and I'm I'm I'm, conf- I'm confident. We had like I said, we had enough talent in the locker room to to make it happen. It was, just came about execution. That's what we, that's what wins, and we know how to win here, you know. And, and what we do, that's that's why we win. So. You talk to you personally, what's next in your progression as a player the rest of your Uh, for me, man, I'm. I'm still chasing, still chasing to be the best every day. You know, I, um, I'm, uh, I want more for myself personally. You know, uh, I feel like I'm just getting started. You know, um, I feel like I, I could do anything I want to do. Um, not to just talk about my goals, but you know, I, I feel like I could, I could, I can definitely be top two. You know, in the league, you know, and I'm gonna keep chasing it until I, until I'm not. When you see other teams like, like the 49ers, like when you see other teams like the 49ers using Debo Samuel the way they use him, I mean, you have similar abilities. Mm-hmm. Is that something you would like to do as well? Um, I mean, yeah, that's cool. You know, that's cool. Debo's a special player. You know, uh, you know, and his skill set is 
it's kind of different from mine, to be honest. You, you know, if you if you compare them, compare the two. But I'm good with the rock in my hands too. And I think I think that's what guys compare it to. But you know, uh, no matter what, however they use me, you know, I'm gonna be happy for it. So. Um, I talked to him, you know, uh, I'm gonna keep the conversation between me and him, but, uh, um, he's a strong guy. He's a strong guy. And, uh, um, I know a lot of people down on him right now, but you know, it's a team game, you know, you know, he, he didn't, he didn't lose the game by himself. How disappointed are you that you and Julio never really got the chance to work together a whole lot this year on the field because you guys being in and out of the lineup and are you right here? That he'll be back? Maybe do that next year. Uh, yeah, it was it, it was it was tough. We was on and off the field, so um, just having him on the field and having all us on the field at the same time, we can. The more the more time we on the field, the better we were going to be. So you know. Uh, I think injuries are part of the game. I mean, for me personally. Um, this past year, I kind of got away from my normal uh, lift routine because I was I was banged up in the off season. So, um, but this time I'm healthy. You know, I can get back to my old ways and I, you know, train, lift heavy, do what I do. You know, so.